Hello folks, this is Ben Gessel. I know there's videos I try and get to you that I haven't quite got to yet. It's just hard to coordinate it, basically. And there's something else I've been getting into as well, which I'll comment on in a later video. But um, this is just basically a, a, my, a recent grocery haul type of thing, grocery video. Uh, PCC Natural Markets, I haven't been there as regularly. You guys maybe have seen only one or two of them uh, recently, these kinds of... Uh, grocery stores but anyway let's get right to this here so just two fresh fruits um, kind of I got some other stuff that's a little bit fruit oriented but kind of minimizing that a little bit okay moose got grapes and um, organic blueberries of course I have some frozen berries which we'll get to in here in a bit and a few other things so of course uh, got organic celery and lots of nice orange organic carrots Romaine lettuce, organic romaine lettuce. These are like spring onions or something like that. A little purple and there's some green onions somewhere around here. Also, green onions right here. Kind of a, yeah. Green onions and spring onions, and there's a little bit of watercress as well. Organic watercress. And we've got some chef's sampler mushrooms. I think that they're uh, Bunishimaji oyster, one other type. I'm sure I'm mispronouncing that. Japanese name. We get these Bunashi Meiji, Meiji beach mushrooms. That was the side, but yeah. So two of those. So love those kinds of mushrooms. And we got two kind of kimchi types, soul kimchi. We got another firefly kimchi. So it's going to be a little bit kimchi ish. Anyway, organic green peas, organic peas and carrots. So here, upside down, I know. Anyway, these are there's two bags of organic broccoli, upside down. <laughs> uh, organic green beans. And I think that's it for the vegetables. Yeah. Getting to some other stuff for the, the produce. Uh, well, frozen. This is Marion Marion blackberries. Or I just call them Marion berries. Uh, from Remlinger Farms, and organic raspberries. Anyway, then we have some Himalayan sea salt, pink sea salt, and, some of that. and then this is that's crushed red pep pepper. I think it's organic or something like that. White sesame seeds from PCC. There's a whole bunch of uh, ground garlic, organic, organic garlic too. And these are other kind of planty things, or these oils and things, extra virgin. First cold pressed olive oil. And get some uh, blue bonnet, calcium, magnesium, citrate, plus vitamin D3. And then some uh, My Kind Organics whole food gummies. And also, this is upside down, but we got some hazelnuts. Two packages of them. Hazelnuts. And two packages of Thai curry roasted cashews. Two of them. A package of spicy pumpkin seeds, dry roasted, organic, and some grass-fed ghee butter. The other one I got recently, I gave to my mom. But this stuff, man, you just never go wrong with that stuff. And then, of course, I got some. Uh, this is uh, something new: hippie snacks, avocado crisps, guacamole. Kind of see what's going on here with the uh, nutrition a little bit. So pretty good stuff. Teensy bit of salt. Yep. A little bit of fat, but nothing bad. No, no fat, no uh, trans fat, of course. Nutrient dense, plant based, gluten free, non GMO. You could do worse. So ingredients are avocado. So avocado, citric acid, coconut milk. Uh, Pumpkin seeds, vinegar, sunflower seeds, brown rice flour, flax seeds, tapioca starch, water, onion powder, lime juice concentrate, sea salt, black pepper, cayenne pepper. It's pretty similar to the other guy. I got another flavor. Just the, uh, I guess they're just avocado crisps. The sea salt variety. Pretty similar stuff. Mustard flour, something like that. Can I see? They got some fiber. Yep. A little bit salty, but snacky stuff. And then 
all these, now it's again upside down, pure little uh, mint things. Four different flavors, most of them minty, and one of them orange at the bottom. And then we got some CB's peanuts, a whole bunch of small packages of them. And then some Zevia grape and black cherry. And this stuff has no sugar, by the way. It's actually a zero carb. It's basically just uh, carbonated water. Wait, yeah, yeah, carbonated water and flavoring. Anyway, pretty cheap. I don't think, yeah, I think they put stevia in there maybe to sweeten it. I don't know. I'm not sure. Now for the meaty stuff. Okay, I, I usually get just a dozen eggs. But I got two dozen this time. I need some more weightlifting, more workout stuff. I need some eggs. A lot of chicken. Um, like six things of chicken thighs or skinless and a few um, chicken drumsticks skin. All organic. I'm trying, I'm trying the sturgeon soon. Fresh wild Columbia uh, River sturgeon steak. It's not too expensive. It's like, eh, could be worse. And then this is my big boy. This is my indulgence. Corned beef brisket, uncured. Uh, is it uh, Banchero Brothers? Corned beef brisket, USA. 3.3 pounds. Need a bit of money. This should last a little while. I think. I'm not sure what, what, I'm going to do that with that yet. I have a pretty good idea. Uh, then some, of course, short ribs. Grass fed. I believe. Yep. Organic, I'm sorry, organ country beef skirt steak. That stuff's really tasty. And then a two shoulder blade chops. Um, both of them grass fed. Pasture raised. Uh, so that definitely was a little bit pricey, but it's going to be worth it. Should last me quite some time. Well into April, I would think. Um, quite a while. Anyway, leave me a touch of comments below. Oh, one more thing. As you can probably guess, I'm definitely trying to cover the bases nutrition-wise. Um, pretty sure I am doing okay here. Maybe could use a little bit more dark leafy greens. Maybe. But I think I got covered the bases pretty well here. Alright. Leave me thoughts in the comments below. Catch you guys later. Take care. Bye.